Hello, my name is Greg Story. I'm the president of Dale Carnegie Training Japan. We all like to feel appreciated. We like to feel we're doing something worthwhile in, in our work, our, our families. We like to feel that uh, we're recognized for that. So if we're trying to build a good environment at work or at home, we're trying to build relationships with other people to be successful, then making them feel that they're important to us is a very, very key thing. Now, often if you're the boss and you've got people working for you, often they don't know why they're working. They don't know why they're doing this particular task. So we have to explain the why. But we also have to explain to them that what they're doing is important, particularly back office jobs, which can be very, very tedious. And the people working there don't really see the connection between them and the big picture. We need to connect them to the big picture. Uh, where people are doing things which are very much just sort of like a one person task, and they don't have to do much with others, and they sometimes forget that what they're doing, uh, if it isn't done, nothing else can get done. We need to point those things out. We need to make them feel that their job is important and what they are doing really helps the whole organisation go ahead. And so helping people to feel important raises their self-esteem. When we're trying to do things that take the organisation forward, they're often new things, they're often things we have to come out of our comfort zone. So that's a scary thing. If people are coming out of their comfort zone trying something new for the first time, giving them confidence to keep going is important. So if we really communicate to them that what they're doing is important, they're doing it well, and we make them feel confident, they're more likely to keep going with that new task and even they strike hurdles, they'll get over those and keep going. So finding a communication means of making feel, people feel important is important. But I'm not talking about flattery. I'm not talking about making them feel important and buttering them up. People have got the most precise flattery meters in their heads. They can tell straight away, oh, this is just flattery. So it's got to be genuine. It's got to be something that you see they're doing that is being done well, and you tell them that, and you explain them why that is important. So it has to be real. It doesn't take much to find those things because people are doing great things all around you. You just haven't been looking for them. Look for them, find them and tell that person what they're doing is important and make them feel that they're a contributor and make them feel important. <laughs>